how can they come to your account and take money out? Self-employed hairstylist Jennifer Miller doesn't understand how it's legal or how it could even happen. My account was negative $700. And I was so confused. After months of waiting and finally getting an unemployment check, what she thought would be her second credit instead was a debit. While she is owed thousands, the state overdrafted her bank hundreds of dollars into the red. It's scary because you don't, there's no one to call. I mean, I know there's numbers they give you, but you can't get through. This email is the only notice. Kansas accidentally gave 4,500 people duplicate payments. Miller wasn't one of them. Rather than offset future payments, Kansas simply withdrew money from thousands of accounts, some by mistake. I'm in a worse situation now than when I asked for help. Miller already bought groceries and paid bills. Still unemployed, she now faces daily $30 overdraft fees from the bank. You took money out of people's private accounts that you authorized to give them, okayed the, them to have, and took it back. And what if they were going to the store an hour after that to feed their kids and then they didn't have it all weekend and then the government's closed so we can't help you? Like, you, what? She's called unemployment, the governor's office and her state representative, no response. Since she works at a retirement facility, she has no date on when she'll be allowed back to work. In Olathe, Brian Johnson, KNBC 9 News.